Okay, here we are in the evening of the first day. And as you can see, it is still looking like it's going to rain, but it's not actually raining right now, so I'm going to get out. No, okay, I take that back. <laughs> it is actually raining now, but hopefully it won't rain very much. Um, we hung some stands over on this side of the property, and there were actually fresh scrapes from this morning. So while we were over in our tree stand, there was at least one buck over here working, and hopefully he went in there, bedded down somewhere, and we'll come back out where we've got the stands. At least that's the plan and hopefully it's not going to rain too much because I'm still wet from this morning. Quite a ways up in a tree. It's obviously a different spot than where we were this morning. Um, we saw the scrapes that were fresh this morning. Right. That wasn't me. Apparently there's trees falling and stuff. Um, I guess it just covers our noise. Hopefully we did.
can see, we've been pretty much covered up by deer since we came in here. And, and I, I mean, we had deer all over the place. Um, I had a couple little bucks, you know, that we weren't going to shoot. And then a bunch of nice dolls. And I drew on two of them and couldn't get shots. And um, I wish I had five of them pass right, right through here. And I drew and couldn't get a shot. And then one of them actually came back. Here she is. Uh, Christine made a perfect shot on this deer tonight. She came in at about, I don't know, eight, ten yards away. We had some really good footage lined up, you know, right over Christine's shoulder. It was going to be a great shot. Unfortunately, the deer kind of spooked a little bit when Christine drawed, drawed, drew, <laughs> drew her bow back. Whatever that attempt was and, that I made. Uh, she, she ran only, I don't know, five yards, maybe something like that. Christine smoked her, made a perfect shot on her. She didn't go 40 yards. We let her lay there. Uh, basically until it got dark because we still had deer around us all night we had deer around us so we didn't want to spook the deer that were there and we were still hopeful that maybe a buck was going to come by we knew where she was at we knew it was going to be an easy tracking job so we elected to let her lay and uh, you know get her out once it got dark so here she is we're going to get her all tagged and cleaned up and in the cooler and we'll be back at it tomorrow morning hopefully get something with antlers on its head next time